times. We started right here. Me and Mike were heading to the UP to list a hunting lodge in the middle of nowhere. First time we had no idea what we were getting into. Six hours there, six hours back. We were pleasantly surprised. The second time we went up for multiple showings and now the three of us head up to close on the lodge. Mike, thoughts? Let's get it done. Here we are at DTW, heading to Florida to set up our network. The boys are heading up north for the closing soon. We'll chat when we're on the ground. Caden had uh, one job, it was to bring an air mattress. Um, I always have one job. Caden uh, <laughs> didn't bring the air mattress. Okay, first stop, coffee stop of the trip. Mike, what'd you get? Uh, mocha latte, iced. Mocha latte, I got a latte. Caden, back here, what'd you get, man? I forgot. Oreo you got ice a, cap. You got an Oreo, ice cap. Ice Oreo ice, cap. ice cap and a chicken Maybe panini. So uh, the trip continues. We have four hours to go. We have three hours and 47 minutes to Harbor Springs. We're going to stay the night at Airbnb. And then we have an early morning tomorrow. So it's going to be fun. Let's do it. I can't wait. <laughs> What's up, kid? Just woke up. What's your favorite kind of jerky? Beef jerky is great. Like the classic beef? Caden's mm -hmm. a classic kind of guy, you know? He's going beef. Mike, how we doing, bro? We're doing great now. We got some uh, jerky outlet going. What flavor did you go with? You had a lot of options to choose from. We went to Hot Hunter Sausage. And what else? Tried did, and true. What else did you get? Um, we got some other goodies here. We got a lot of meat. We got a lot of protein in here. Woo! Smoked look beef. at that. Salty Colorado. Come on, man. We'll see. That looks good. Stage one. Nothing says Italian. All right. Check it out, man. Vaulted ceiling, skylights. This is cool. Quick, what kind of flooring is this? Tile. <laughs> <laughs> We're here. We made it. Now we gotta find some food. Some good food. Mm. Some wine. Yes. Is it locked? Did you lock it? All right, kid. <laughs> Mission is. We have arrived. Airbnb is. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and say better than expected. I thought it was gonna be cool, but. It, didn't let me down. Now the hunt is for some really, really good, the best wine that we can find in Harbor Springs at 5.30 on a Thursday night. Best wine on a budget. budget. No budget, wow. no budget. <laughs> Just hit the ground in Tampa. Gonna grab the luggage and head over to SRQ and begin our networking. Here we are in Sarasota on our way to visit Premier Sotheby's downtown Sarasota. We're very excited to begin networking with Florida for Lux Partners Global. This one mine? This one's mine? It's yours. What do we got, Mike? We have on the menu tonight, we have a nice Caesar salad, beautiful shrimp and butter sauteing right now, and then we have a wonderful prosciutto ravioli in tomato sauce. And that's dinner. That's just. We just threw something together that we could find at the grocery store, so. This looks like a perfect, like, welcome to Mike's Kitchen. Welcome to Mike's Kitchen. Today, we're thinking Italian. So we got some shrimp here that we're gonna start off with. Get a couple of these bad boys on here. And then we're gonna get a little of the tortellini and the nice garlic tomato sauce here. And uh, don't you worry, this plate's a little tiny, but we're gonna fit it on. Put a salad on the side. Joe would be proud Caesar. of you, Mike. Ooh, look at that. And that's dinner. Oh. That's how we do it. Bing, bang, boom. Bingo, bango, bango. Bingo, bango, bango. That's <laughs> one. You know? I got Orange bread. Orange bread. Bing, bango. Mike, thanks for cooking, man. Yeah, no problem. One, two. So, we got two peanut butter what game we're gonna play, we don't know yet. Something, we don't have audio or TV, so. 
Wi Fi's down. We're off you the know, grid. We're, guys, we're off the grid. We're in northern <laughs> Michigan in November. It's I'm just gonna, I'm going for this. Okay. Well, that's, there's a, well, there's a show on it. But... I know, ready? <laughs> ready? It Might. sounds like it sounds like you got the shell with it. Mm. Oh yeah. So we are wait, wait. on the road. Wait, 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 real quick. Move your autofocus point. It's at the top left right now. Right. There you go. So, you, know, that's, you know, that's why we take Caden along. <laughs> Stuff like that. The guy's good. Um, so we're on the road. It's dark. It's a little chilly, but it's not too bad. And today is the day we close on the hunting lodge. Mikey Mike. I'm excited. At the wheel, ready to rock. We have not had our first coffee of the day yet, though, so. You know, it's still a little rusty. A little rusty. So last night, a little bit of cab salve, and I forgot we played some three-man euchre. Guys, do you remember who, who won the first game? You know, it's a little fuzzy. I don't recall. Caden, do you remember who won the who won the second game? Do you remember that? That's, I, a, little, that's I, a little fuzzy too. I don't, think, I don't think I remember. I think the third game was Mike. Yeah, yeah. Kaden's got it. I do remember that. It's yeah, weird. I don't remember sure. a third game at all. So I don't. Yeah, <laughs> it's our memory is slipping. It's it's yeah. I'm thinking though, from what I remember, I've just got breaks of victory. You mean when we were teaching Caden how to play and we weren't playing for for realsy? Oh, no, yeah. no, no. I mean the real. No, I mean the real games. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Huh. Well. Well. Uh, after coffee, maybe we'll remember. If we didn't film it, I don't know if it happened. So. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, yeah, we uh, we're on the open road and the adventure starts today. Day two, Florida, 79 degrees, sun's out, heading over to Sotheby's in downtown Sarasota to meet with the broker and one of his teams to set up our networking. This is the end of the road. We are at the hunting lodge. It is completely cleared out. Last time we were here, there were over 150 animals in this house, in this main room. Um, again, we've got you know five miles of trails, seven hunting blinds. This thing is the ultimate hunting paradise. And now it's completely empty. So we're doing a final walkthrough. Both the buyers and the sellers are here. Title agency, we're gonna sign off. And it's the end of the road. So this was our favorite room in the house. This was like walking into, and it still is, but this was completely decorated like a, closest thing I could say is like a Cracker Barrel. But I mean, it was, you had animal pelts, different animals, this complete bar set up. You still got the original stove. You had a little bar area here. But this is just, this is 5,000 square feet, and this is just a piece of it. So now the new owner is gonna use this for his dog kennel. He's got a bunch of hunting dogs. They're gonna come right in here and they're gonna bed down in here and sleep. This is gonna be closed off and this is gonna to continue to be like a bar entertaining hangout. It's cold, man. <laughs> so we're in the UP. Backstory quick to the house. About six months ago, we got a call from Larry, the homeowner. He wanted to sell a luxury hunting lodge in the UP. Now that was six hours from our home base, our office in downtown Detroit in Gross Point. We took the call and we decided, you know what? We're gonna come up because this is a special, unique, storied home. He custom built this and he's a big game hunter. So we said, we're gonna drive up to the UP and we'll check out the property and we will do what we do for marketing homes. So we did just that. Me and Mike jumped in the car, we drove up. We were pleasantly surprised because this place is absolutely gorgeous. 5,000 square feet, sauna. It has its own pole barn with meat processing station, five miles of trails, seven heated hunting blinds. The place is ridiculous. So the key is finding that right buyer, right? This is a very specific property and you've got to find that right person. So we did a listing video. We did beautiful pictures. We told the story. We posted it on all of our Sotheby's branded affiliate links and we ran ads on Facebook 
and Instagram and LinkedIn and YouTube. And one of the stories that we ran through MSN, a, a buyer not too far from here saw online and he had been looking for the perfect hunting lodge for close to two years. And this was just outside of the radius he was searching for, but when he saw that article, he read it, fell in love with it, and he met us here um, just about two months ago on our second trip to the UP. He walked through the house once and he was the buyer. So you never know where the buyer is going to come from, but as long as you do the marketing right on your end and uh, everything else falls into place. So here we are at the closing today. We're representing both the seller of the home and the buyer. They're here with us today. We're actually helping them pack up the last few things and get them in the car. And it's been a good story all around. He's on it. Oh, he's sliding right in. I'm past the last mattress layer. Okay. Really? Bingo, bingo, bungo. That's what I was, that's what I was searching for. <laughs> Checking hand, how do you feel, man? I feel great. I'm happy Larry and Sandy got their new place. Everything worked out. Matt, the new owner, is really cool. He's gonna do some really cool things to the house. Overall, it's win, win, win. So, it's a great day. Great day. Lots of footage, drone shots, purple hands. We got it all. It's been good. It's been accomplished. We uh, successful closing. Taking off now. The Lux boys and, and Caden are gonna celebrate tonight. Going to do a little content on the way back. We've got another night in Harbor Springs. We're going to get some, uh, going to get some good food and some vino, and then it's back home tomorrow morning. I don't know. Another episode of uh, Cooley in the Kitchen, or are we going to have uh, Nick, Nick take over the reins? Cooley in the Kitchen. I, you know, that doesn't sound like a bad. Let's get some more <laughs> shrimp on the Barbie, man. <laughs> right, what do we got? What do Can we got? Rolling. Day two. We got some uh, Italian sausage ravioli, some uh, meat sauce here. We get some pizza in the oven. Ooh. And as always, a little wine, a little Caesar salad here. Another Caesar. And for dessert, gotta feed the boys. Dessert. Only the best. Fudge trippers. Hundred and fifty dollar cookies. Guess what time it is? It's almost sunset time. Look at Ooh. that. Well, our, our view is a bunch of rain and some really cold uh, clouds. So. Yeah, we have rain and sleet right now, Joe. Wrapping up another day here in Sarasota, Lux Partners Global. Looking forward to 2021 networking in Sarasota.